all of my subscribers and viewers know, I made a previous video about Paul Pierce on IG Live uh, with strippers, um, partying, playing poker. And this man has a wife and three kids. <laughs> Even more, he has a job with ESPN, which I told everyone, you sign a clause. You, you sign that you're not going to do anything that puts uh, the company in jeopardy because you represent ESPN. I don't care if you're going to take a shit. You represent ESPN while you're on that toilet because you signed a contract with them. And this is something that, I hate to say this, that niggas just say, fuck that shit. It's something he probably didn't like about the job or it's something that he wanted to prove to somebody. I even tried to you know, hit this nigga up on Twitter like, bro, you good? You know, because he's one of Inglewood's finest. You know, I respect the brother. Paul Pierce, one of the greatest NBA players of all time. I just wanted to know was he all right for what he was doing, you know. I just thought it was kind of awkward. No response. Of course, that's what your favorite celebrities do when they get a lot of money. Now, to the breaking news. His ass is fired. In the words of Vincent K. <laughs> McMahon, yeah. Paul Pierce out at ESPN days after a while twerking on IG. Uh, Paul Pierce from ESPN is officially over. The network is parting ways with the ex-NBA superstar just days at the Pierce posted a racy twerk session and some uh, clad women on IG. Now, it's unclear if the video is the reason Pierce departure. What? Hold on. Of course it's the fucking video. That's the, <laughs> He was just working there until the video dropped. <laughs> Damn. I wasn't even going to read that part, people. I'll carry on. Now, uh, Pierce had the best IG Live. THV Mo tweeted, like... You know, this, look what this nigga got in his mouth, bro. Some said that's a cigar. Others said this nigga was smoking some of that uh, chronic, that West Coast chronic straight up. So, um, shit. If you're going to do all that, bro, I mean, just just live your life, man. But you would no longer be looked at as a uh, analyst at ESPN. Your um, role model shit goes out the door when they catch you drinking and smoking. Kid, you can't, you won't cater shit to kids anymore. But uh, also note, noteworthy is that uh, the timing of the move is interestingly interesting, especially since the NBA season is all but over. But Pierce spent three point five years on the network, appearing on NBA Countdown and The Jump. Now. The ex-Celtics forward seemingly addressed a split on Twitter just minutes ago saying big things coming soon. Stay tuned. Make sure you smile. The truth shall set you free. Now, Paul Pierce also shared a four-second video with the message showing himself laughing and smiling. Look at this shit. <laughs> this nigga must be still high. <laughs> <laughs> and I give it no fuck. So Pierce played 19 years in the uh, NBA before joining ESPN. He was a he has a 10 time All Star. He's a 10 time All Star, bro, and won a title with Ray Allen and Garnett in 08. And he was named the NBA Finals MVP. Some accolades that a lot of niggas would never ever have. And, and let's not forget, Pierce was entertaining as an analyst. Even if when he did say some unorthodox shit, he was entertaining. But hey, I guess this is all we can say about this. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs>